Good morning. I'm Jeannie Snedeker. I'm the director of Christian Education, and I'd like to invite our children forward. Hi, Soren. Hi, Tommy. Good morning. How are you guys? Oh, look at your pizza dresses. I love those. So pretty. Well, good morning, everyone. I'm so glad you're with me today. Well, it's a busy time, isn't it? My goodness. Now, we're in the season of Advent. Does anybody remember what Advent means? What are we doing right now? We're doing something. Anyone? We're celebrating the birth of Jesus. We are. We're celebrating, and we're getting ready to celebrate. We're waiting, and we're... Do you guys know the word anticipating? We're getting ready, and we're excited about celebrating the birth of Jesus. But I got to tell you, it's busy, isn't it? I brought my calendar to show you. Oh, look at all that stuff. And I got, I've got, I got sticky notes on top of what I've written down because I didn't have enough room to write it all. So, and then the really important things I highlighted in yellow, I really have to show up for those things, right? What do you have to show up for? What's important going on with you right now? Anything? Does anybody have anything important at school? No concerts? No pageants? Wow. I'm impressed. I know when our kids were growing up, it seemed like Andrew and I had to clear our schedules as best we could to show up for them all the time for all of their important things too, right? Well, when we value something, when something is really important to us, we show up. We find a way to give it our time and our energy and our love. And I was thinking, that's exactly what God has done for us. God loves us so much and cherishes us so much that God made the decision to come down to earth, to not be a far, far away God, but to be an up-close God, to live and walk among us, to be present with us. And that's who Jesus is, God with us. And that song we just sang, I love Advent music. I was saying this this morning at our meeting. I love Advent hymns. They're some of my very favorite hymns. But the word Emmanuel that we just sang, in the Bible it's another name for Jesus and it means God is with us. Well, showing up is not always easy, is it? Because we're busy. I mean, look at all this stuff. We're distracted sometimes, and sometimes we're just plain tired. You guys ever get tired and don't want to do things? Yeah, I think we do too. Grown-ups do too. But as we prepare our hearts for Jesus' birth, that's part of it, that we have to consider how we are going to show up for the important things. And do you know those important things aren't parties or concerts, even though those are fun and important, but... The really big things that we show up for are loving one another and caring for one another and helping others who are in need. Those are the things we think about, and those are the things that we show up for. Just as God has shown up for us, we are called to show up for one another. And in that way, we reflect God's awesome love for us. Okay? So let's say a prayer, and then we'll go to Sunday school. Dear Jesus... We are so excited as we wait for you. Thank you for loving us so much that you came to live among us. Help us to show up for one another as you show up for us every day. Amen. Okay, guys, let's go to Sunday school.